You feel a roti sabji gives you a lot of nutrition in the tiffin. But sometimes with the same ingredients, you can make something different which is equally healthy. So how about doing a mixed vegetable muthiya? So let's see how it's done. For the mixed vegetable, I'm using a bottle gourd here, which is grated and soaked in the water. So just squeeze out the extra water. Take it in a bowl. Some grated carrots. And this is some fresh fenugreek. Add some salt. Mix and keep it aside for about 10 minutes. When you keep it aside, it will leave some water. So let's keep it aside and then we can add the flask to it. Till that is happening, we'll keep the steamer ready. So I have some water which is kept in the pan below and I have the steamer on the top. We had kept it aside for about 10 minutes and you can see it's left some water out. So we'll try and add the flour to it. So we have some whole wheat flour, some gram flour, some coriander powder, some turmeric powder, chilli powder, some garam masala, some roasted cumin powder, we have some green chilli paste and some ginger paste. It really turns out very tasty with so many things that has gone in. Sugar and some soda bicarbonate for it to go really light. Mix it. You have to mix it with your hand because you want to make it like a soft dough and you have to roll it into cylinders before you put it into steaming. But normally the name Muthiya, traditionally it means that Muthi means a fist. So when you take these little dumplings and you press them in between your fist, you get these elongated Muthiyas, which you can separately do them in this shape also and steam them. But nowadays you normally roll them in a cylinder, it becomes easier then you can uh, cut them into rounders and then temper it. So either way you can do it, whatever you're comfortable with. It is nicely got kneaded into a soft dough and the steamer is also ready. So let's roll it out into a thin cylinder before we put it for steaming. Cover and let it steam for about 10 to 12 minutes. The mutias are steaming for about 10 to 12 minutes. They are done. Shut the gas. Yes. Let them cool down till we cut into rounders and give it a nice tempering. The cylinders of the mutias that we have done steamed, they are gone cold. So let's cut them into rounders before we temper them. The mutias are cut into slices. So let's temper it. This is one way of doing it, even the small muthiyas, if you do it with a fist, you have to just follow the same procedure and the same way you have to temper it in oil. Add oil. The oil has gone hot, let's start tempering it. So in goes some mustard seeds, some cumin seeds, sesame seeds, some curry leaves and some asafoetida. Add the mutias. Just toss them for a minute or so. Shut the gas and let's serve it with some chutney. We are taking it along with some green chutney, but you can always take it with ketchup if the kids love it. The mixed vegetable mutias are ready, a little tedious procedure. But you can always steam and keep them the previous night and give the tempering in the morning. And it's a nice nutrition dish which you can give in the tiffin. 
It's served with some green chutney, but you can always take it with some ketchup. Definitely make it in the tiffin someday and hit the like button, subscribe and share. For more such delicious recipes, stay tuned to Sanjeev Kapoor Khazana.